Okay, we have a special event to tell you about happening next weekend. It's the Race for the Rescues here in Los Angeles. To tell us about it, actor Seamus Dever and his pet friend is here with us this morning. Good morning. It's me, it's not Oliver. This is <laughs> Oliver the dog. And, hey, Oliver. Oh, and Oliver's a rescue from um, the rescue in Los Angeles. Yes, he's from the rescue train. We've had him for four months now. Um, the Race for the Rescues benefits uh, 18 different local rescue groups, which is kind of cool because they all come there. A lot of them bring their dogs. Uh -huh. um, it's a great event. It's a lot of fun. Um, it, it was the first time I did it a couple years ago. I brought my, um, my beagle and we ran the 5K. Um, and a lot of people bring their dogs and run with it. So uh, me and my beagle, we found a pack mm -hmm. and we ran with them. It was a lot of fun. And what better way to do it than with man's best friend, right? right. Not only are, is there a 5K, there's a 10K, mm -hmm. and there's also a 1K for your dog. Yes, bring your dog and walk. It's sort of fun because um, all the dogs walk together. So it's like a huge dog walk. And it's next weekend at the Rose Bowl on, a, is it Saturday or Sunday? It's on Saturday. It's on a Saturday. Saturday okay. the 18th. The 18th. Uh, early registration begins at 7 and the race begins at 8.30. There's a lot of fun things. Why do you think it's so important that we hold an event like this here in Southern California? Well, it's a great place. If anyone's interested in, um, it's a great place for dog owners, for people who already have dogs, people who are curious about adopting a dog, adopting a rescue, because there's lots of possibilities there. Um, you can even adopt on spot. Um, LA, uh, the LA Animal Control will be there as well mm -hmm. as the Pasadena Humane Society. They're going to bring a lot of their dogs so dogs actually from the shelter um, as well as these local rescue groups and you're doing something unique it's Kyle it's like a rockin fashion show with the dogs uh, yeah there's gonna be <laughs> a, a little bit of uh, a little bit of fun that we have with some of the uh, the dogs available for adoption so you can see them and showcase them I think I'm, I I think it's rockin adoption right? rockin adoption <laughs> yeah I, I there might be some fashion but it might be more from the owners than the dogs but uh, yeah it's gonna be a lot of fun we got the Laker girls are gonna be there as well as the uh, LA Kings ice crew so it's gonna be fun great family event mm -hmm. uh, you also expanded this year last month you had something in Portland, you're not having one at the Rose Bowl, and then mm -hmm. in case folks can't make it to the LA County one, there's one in Orange County next yeah, month. Yeah, as well, correct, correct. Okay, so, uh, sorry. Oh, no, and it's, it's going to be a lot of fun. I'm, I'm going to say, uh, come out, uh, meet me if you want, um, and uh, my partner from the show I work on, um, John Huertas, he'll be there as well, so we're both hosting. And, you know, with all the money that you raise, what, where does it go toward? Is it research, or is it to help save more of these rescue animals? Well, it's it's split evenly, I believe, for, for, all, the, um, for all the rescue groups, which they sort of are the grassroots efforts. Um, you, you know, you hear about the big rescue organizations, but then it's the little ones, uh, sort of the mom and pop shops, if you will, that, that run these rescues. They're the people you see at the Petco parking lot on Saturday and Sunday mornings. They're those people. It benefits them directly. And how did you get involved? <clears throat> Is this something near and dear to your heart? Um, I seem to know a ton of people who have rescue groups, and, and my friend Jamie runs Rescue Train, which is the organizers uh -huh. of Race for the Rescue. So I, I started doing this about four or five years ago and had a lot of fun. I said, okay, well, how can I be more and more involved? And then that's how you got Oliver. Yeah, Oliver. He's been with us for four months. Aww. He's from Rescue Train. Um, and he's a little sweetie. They found him in North Hollywood. Uh -huh. um, and he had a broken pelvis. He had been uh -huh. hit by a car. Uh, and a broken leg as well. And he had been shot by a BB gun. He still got a BB lodged in his oh head. Oh my goodness. But um, what's great is that he is a super good dog and he, it's nice to see that, that these dogs get a second chance. They yes. rescued him, spent a lot of money on rehab. Um, that's also what a lot of these funds go to is, is um, vet bills right. and, and rehab. Um, and he's, he's a great dog. And so we gave him a nice second chance and he's turned into this like awesome little dog. Look at those, huh? look look those, those eyes. eyes. They have those, a little bit those of Lady blue. killers, <laughs> lady killers. Thank you so much, Shane. Once Absolutely. again, the race for the rescue in L.A. is next Saturday. It's at the Rose Bowl. Then on Sunday, November 16th in Orange County, you can join the race for the rescues in Oak Canyon Park in Silverado. For more information, just head to our website, kcount9.com. Click Scene on TV.